let us solve the exercise 7 b of partial fractions. So, first one resolve 2 x square plus 3 x plus 4 by x minus 1 into x square plus 2. So, now this 2 x square plus 3 x plus 4 by x minus 1 into x square plus 2. Now, we have to apply rule number 1 and rule number 3. So, for x minus 1 there will be a partial fraction a by x minus 1 for x square plus 2 that is b x plus c by x square plus 2. Now, 2 x square plus 3 x plus 4 by x minus 1 into x square plus 2 equals to x minus 1 into x square plus 2 a into x square plus 2 plus b x plus c into x minus 1. Now, these two gets cancelled a into x square plus 2 plus b x plus c into x minus 1 equals to 2 x square plus 3 x plus 4. Since, we have x minus 1 1 linear factor put x is equal to 1. If you put x is equal to 1 this become 0. So, a into 1 square 1, 1 plus 2, this is 2 plus 3 plus 4. So, 3 a equals to 9, a equals to 3. Now, we have to compare the coefficients only, there is no other way. So, now equating x square coefficients on both sides. Here a into x square a x square b x into x b x square. So, a plus b we get a plus b a plus b equals to here we have x square coefficient is 2. So, this one. So, 2. So, equation 1. Already we know a value. So, put a value 3. So, a plus 3 is equal to 2. a equals to 2 minus 3 which equal to a equal to minus 1. Now, here a is equal to 3 means this must be b ok b. So, b is equal to minus 3 b becomes minus 1. So, we know a value b value only c we have to find out. So, equating constants equating constant terms constant terms means a into 2 c into minus 1 that is 2 a minus c equals to 4. Now, a value is 3 so, again substitute this a value here 6 minus c is equal to 4 minus c is equal to minus 2 c is equal to 2. So, now a b c we have to write therefore, 2 x square plus 3 x 
plus 4 by x minus 1 into x square plus 2 a a is 3 3 by x minus 1 plus b x plus c b x plus c means minus x plus 2 that is 2 minus x by x square plus 2 these are the required partial fractions. Second problem. Three x minus one by one minus x plus x square x plus two. We have to resolve into partial fractions. So, in this case, one minus x plus x square is nothing but irreducible quadratic factor. So, there exists a partial fraction of the form a x plus b by x square minus x plus 1 or 1 minus x plus x square. x plus 2 is a linear factor. So, that is actually c by x plus 2. 3 x minus 1 by this is x square minus x plus 1 x plus 2 equals to a x plus b by x square minus x plus 1 plus c by x plus 2. 3 x minus 1 by x square minus x plus 1 x plus 2 is equal to x square minus x plus 1 into x plus 2. So, a x plus b into x plus 2 plus c of x square minus x plus 1. This this gets cancelled. We have a x plus b of x plus 2 plus c of x square minus x plus 1 equal to 3 x minus 1. Now, put x is equal to minus 2, this becomes 0, c of 4 plus 2 plus 1 minus 6 minus 1. So, this is 7 c equal to minus 7. So, c is equal to minus 1. So, now equating equating x square coefficients on both sides. So, now a x into x a x square a c x square plus c there is no x square coefficient 0 already c value is known minus 1 a minus 1 is equal to 0. So, a 1 not a 1 a is equal to 1. Now, equating constant terms, constant terms on both sides, on both sides. Constant terms means here c b into 2 2 b c into 1 c 2 b plus c equals to minus 1, already c is equal to minus 1. 2 b minus 1 is equal to minus 1, 2 b is equal to minus 1 plus 1, 0 b becomes 0. So, therefore, partial fractions of the problem 3 x minus 1 by 1 minus x plus x square into x plus 2 
is equal to a x plus b a means 1 b 0. So, x by 1 minus x plus x square plus c, c means minus 1. So, minus 1 by x plus 2, these are the partial fractions.